Hello, today I have the Besman VR M2. This is a, a modification which fits the Bobo VR M2 and it also works with the stock strap of the Oculus Quest 2. I'll show you this uh, mounted in a moment, but first I want to show you uh, how this works on the Bobo VR M2. But I'll just show you it like this first so you can see what it is. Effectively, it is a uh, back of the head padding and um, it also has some extra bits and pieces so just watch the video in the top corner you can see the installation of course and uh, yeah there's a nice little uh, battery cable there as well so simple enough guys you can see that is fitted onto that um so and of course what you need to do is you, you remove the original padding which is uh, installed on the back of here you can see it is the shape of that and it is uh, it has increased the surface area of the headrest at the back. In a video which I reviewed the Bobo VR M2, I had problems with it, and um, Besman VR actually reached out to me and said, "We saw your video. You saw you had problems with the uh, with this head strap." And um, in that review, I said, "Don't get it. I think it is absolutely terrible, <laughs> basically." And a lot of people actually um, made comments in the video description of the review and said they had the same problem as me. And the problem is, it's got a really poor balance on it. Um, the padding here doesn't grip the back of your head, and because the the visor is front heavy, I, I was having a problem where this thing was basically tipping forward, and it was always whenever I put it on my head, um, it wanted to tip forward, and it always rested top of the bridge of my nose and in that position and it just wasn't good enough I mean it was absolutely terrible so yeah I hated this product um, basically guys and um, and um, uh, and Besman VR have come to the rescue with this kit because uh, one thing I mentioned in my review I said if it had a bit of, you know extra weight at the back I think it would hold it up and it'd fit and it'd work and I also said if I had something you know a larger surface area at the back as well that would help and uh, that's exactly what this does. It is, um, you know, this is the, you know, it's the equivalent of doubling the surface area in the back. It, it grips the back of your head and the bottom of your base of your head, and it holds it up. And the battery pack weight actually gives it a perfect equilibrium of balance. I'm just show you that. Instead of doing this all the time, it is now absolutely perfectly balanced. And just let me just show you that, guys. Uh, you can just see I'm holding it by the top strap here. And it is brilliant. It is, it is a lot better, a lot better. Although I will say though, guys, um, I am sort of loathe to recommend you suddenly go out and buy the Bobo VR M2 because to make it for me fit for purpose and actually a usable head strap product um, is it requires a third party. Um, well, a third party head strap requires requires a third party mod to improve it. And in fact, that's the kind of amazing thing about it that this is um, a different company. Besman VR have actually you know, marketed this as a product to improve the, the Bobo VR M2, which is bonkers, isn't it? I mean, out of the box, this uh, Bobo VR M2 should be, you know, fit for purpose, and it's not. It requires a third-party mod. So yes, if you have um, this head strap, fair enough. You know, if you're having problems with it, then this is the fix for it, guys. Um, and if you haven't been able to return, you know, the strap and you don't like using it, then that's again that's the solution. But um, you know, it is better and it's more comfortable and it does actually fit very well now. It does hold up nicely. Um, not my favorite head strap still. That still goes to the Kiwi design um, uh, strap, which I have reviewed and I'll put a link in the description to that. That's still better than this. Um, it's, it's marginal, but it's still better. The, the rigidity of the uh, Kiwi design one just seems to work better for me. It just seems to hold up better and it just feels uh, more secure and but this is actually pretty good um like this so i'm um, you know and if i didn't have the kiwi design head strap i would end up using this kind of assembly with the uh with the Breswin vr p2 and i'd be happy with it so you know so let's put in context that yes i would actually be okay with this head strap uh, but there's still a better option out there than the bobo vr m2 and that is the um the kiwi design elite strap upgrade um yeah so that's the one i'd go for but yeah if you want to if you want to improve the bobo vr m2 then this is the way to do it guys um it is definitely an improvement 
uh, better balance, more comfortable, and uh, yeah, um, I'd have to say, yeah, definitely makes this head strap fit for purpose. So yeah, very good modification. Uh, the Beswin VR P2 is a great mod. Um, fits really well. See the battery pack on the on the you know is great. Also looks like it you know it's it looks like it's part of the head strap as well. It it sort of like integrates very you know very nicely without looking like some sort of like um, sort of Franken mod, uh, which I kind of like. Um, so yeah, pretty good, pretty good guys. So let's move on to fitting it with the fabric strap. So here you go, I fitted it now to the back of the fabric strap and you can just see it just slides on very nicely. Uh, I'll just do the final fitting uh, right now, guys. Um, okay. So let's uh, thread this through here. Visor back on. Clip the sides on. See, it resembles a head strap now, as we had before. And let's just do the final touches. We get the battery pack on there. So I'll just show you how it fits on. Yeah, this battery's going nowhere. It really holds it tight in there. Once you uh, hold it in there, you can see it's, it really holds it in with a lot of friction. So you're not gonna have a problem with it coming off. And you can just see how solid it is against the back of the padding here. So it doesn't wobble around, it's very good. So yeah, it's, uh, it's, it does, uh, you won't notice it. And that's the good thing about it because it fits so tightly and uh, flush to the back of the strap. Final thing is uh, we'll fit the battery cable and uh, this is what this uh, kind of strange looking strap is for get it right around it's there to just hold the cable in place like that so um, yeah it just gives it a bit of protection um, the other thing you can do is uh, you thread it through there and just hold it up and then uh, yeah just finally plug the battery in there and away you go guys perfect so yeah it works really well and I have to say actually I, having used this as well this assembly with the fabric strap I have to say it transforms the comfort of the fabric strap because this um, elastic strap is, it doesn't do a great job. I mean, I'm sure, you know, you know what I'm talking about, right? Um, you know, it's utilitarian, but it always feels, you know, it doesn't fit very well. You have to have it super tight. Um, and with the battery on the back and this, basically this extra surface area, it is super comfortable. It's surprisingly comfortable, I must admit. Um, and what happens is because the strap at the top is not, you know, it is, it is uh, stiff, it's not flexible what happens is the battery kind of pulls it up and you do get really good balance of this. Surprisingly good. Um, yeah, so if you like the fabric strap, you want to keep the fabric strap because you like the portability of it being a smaller, you know, smaller unit, um, then this is a fantastic upgrade and I'd highly recommend, you know, this uh, Beswin VRP2 for this, for this assembly because it does transform it. It turns it into something which is, can be uncomfortable and you know and 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 ill-fitting with the fabric strap to something that actually is very very good and i say like i said surprisingly good um so yeah it works really well and uh yeah it looks good 
and it just worked guys so yeah no complaints actually about that and indeed you know back to the Bobo VR M2 installation as I said you know it, it fixes the problem I had with this head strap but you know um, I'm not going to use this I'm still going to go back to the Kiwi design um, head strap but you know certainly I'd be quite happy to continue using this had I not if I did not have something which is still better than this but yeah, that's the way it goes, guys. You know, Bobo VR M2. If you like this head strap, fine, fair enough, guys. Like I said, you know, it's not for me. It's not for me. There are better products out there, which is why I'm using something better uh, on it on my on my Quest 2. Uh, but yeah, this works good. <laughs> that works well. You know, that works well. So yeah, the Bezman VR P2 gets a, basically a thumbs up for me because um. You know, it does a good job on both the head, head straps, the head strap on that and the head strap on that. Um, yeah, can't go wrong, guys. So there you go. Hope you found this video useful. Uh, I'll be back soon with something new. So stay tuned. And uh, yeah, bye-bye.